Hey, welcome back to the channel. These are the Nike Dunk Lows in the light Orwood Brown Shashiko colorway. And I thought I would just share with you five interesting features of this shoe. I've always enjoyed the Shashiko treatment of a Nike silhouette. And it's because it has a like sort of hand-drawn quality to it. When you look at the stitching, when you look at the overall aesthetic, um, it feels a little bit more DIY or a little bit more kind of like handcrafted. And so let's dive into some of the really unique features of this particular shoe. The first feature of this sneaker that I wanted to point out is the upper material. It's this textile, it's canvas, I think. It looks almost like corduroy, but it has a nice feel to it. It's this light cream, and it's pretty uniform across the entire sneaker. The one detail that I'll point out is how the pattern, you know, the stripe pattern that you can see up close has different orientations depending on the panel. So the mudguard is more vertical, the toe box is more diagonal. But then if you look at the like the, the quarter panels and the back panels, they're they're consistent across the left and right sneaker. And so I think there was intentionality there. And so it just really looks nice. The the different uh, angles of weaving uh, creates a, a little bit more complex looking sneaker overall. So I like that. The second detail, which is a trademark of like a Shashiko treated sneaker, is the stitching. You see the stitching across the borders of all the panels, and it's in this olive or dark brown uh, color. And what I love about it is it's just very pronounced. Um, it's it's meant to be shown, and so you, you have that high contrast. And I like this characteristic a lot because it really makes the sneaker feel like it was hand stitched and uh, there's slight variations in it and this might be more intentional or more pronounced but like the spacing between the border of the panel and the stitching varies ever so slightly i think what i really like about this feature is that it, it almost feels like a kid drew it up and this the youthfulness is there and there's a spirit of playfulness uh, that's conveyed through the stitching. The third detail that I really like about this sneaker is the cross stitching that replaces the perforation that you would find on like a traditional leather sneaker. I think this is a really cool little touch. It's in red and I think that just adds a nice little pop to the sneaker and breaks up the pale ivory across the upper. And it's also on the back and it replaces the Nike branding and so um, if you're not a fan of like just overt branding, then this is possibly a shoe for you, but I like the cross stitching pattern. Um, it reminds me very much of that Shashiko, uh, you know, aesthetic. And so I think that's a nice little touch to this particular sneaker. The fourth detail that I really like is the lace holes. And I particularly like the red ones up here. Uh, the ones towards the toe box in the middle are all in this like white sparkly threading that it, that borders the holes. But the three red ones up here just add a nice little pop and it's sort of unique. Uh, I don't see a lot of that on, on Nike Dunk. So I really like that detail. The fifth detail that I really like is the tongue. It's made out of the same like textile material as the upper, but it's a little bit more padded and it feels softer. I like the red branded tongue tag, but I also like the border of the tongue, which is in a darker, almost like a gray color. And so you get this pale ivory tongue and then it's wrapped around in this darker gray um, border. And then the tongue tag just makes it pop and so i really like this feature overall a very elegant yet simple dunk with a unique upper design that shishiko treatment brings out canvas as the upper material it gives us sort of this hand stitch diy feel you get hits of red in the red cross stitching on the front as well as the back uh, red tongue tag red lace holes so it just adds a nice color combination it reminds me of the Phantom Jim Red uh, Jordan 1 Highs. And I've always enjoyed Shashiko shoes, especially the fours, which I still want to get. Um, so overall, a great dunk. Let me know what you thought about these sneakers. Did you get these? Did you get the denim ones, which I also really liked? Let me know in the comments below. Hit that like button, subscribe to the channel if you wanna follow along. And thank you for watching. I'll catch you again.
Peace.